Hi, this is just a little update to let you know some stuff about me that you might not know. For one thing, I'm pretty active on Google+, Plus, beyond just comments and stuff about videos that I've seen or posting my own videos and so on. Uh, I'm involved with a lot of things that have nothing to do with Minecraft, and you can see a reflection of it on my Google Plus page. So if you haven't decided to follow me on Google Plus, I hate to say follow, but if you're interested in what I'm uh, interested in, uh, that's a good place to go to learn about all kinds of stuff from science to children's rights to the future of uh, gaming. Uh, for instance, this one right here. Uh, was this the right one? Blah, blah, blah. Consider entertaining media. Blah. Oh, yes. Uh, about the fact that in the UK, women are now the majority of gamers. Also, 25% of gamers are older people. So I am going to be making a video about that in the future. Here's something that really scared me. This is the interest in science uh, in the United States. This is what I think this was. Uh, this was taken off of Google Trends. And uh, let's see, this I think it starts in like 2005. And you see there's a little dip in every year. That's summer break. But if you look over here, what's happened since 2014, look at that. Uh, summer break was getting more interest back in 2005 than even the full school term is right now. It's almost flat. Look at that. There's no interest in science anymore. That really scares me for uh, the United States and for technology and for, oh, our abilities to compete in the world, especially since we're getting ready to go to outer space and stuff. Here's a wonderful mod I want to try called Headcrumbs, but I can't get it to download right now. So uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff on my uh, page that has nothing to do with YouTube and stuff, although you're seeing a lot of YouTubes right now. Uh, and it's a good way to find out what kinds of things I'm interested in, especially since uh, the focus of my channel is on uh, gaming for everybody. And so that's a place you can go. I also have a Twitter account. I, again, am interested in a lot of things. I don't know that you would be interested in what I'm interested in, but you could go over and check it out. It's under the name R. Riverstone. That's my original YouTube name and so on. So uh, it's a good place to find out what I'm interested in any, anyway. And I'm interested in a lot of stuff. Here's my home so you can see some of the uh, feeds that I'm following. Uh, let's see. A lot of stuff about NASA and uh, science. A lot of stuff about the future of gaming and the people in it. And not just gaming, but just real life stuff about uh, education and how people are being integrated into the world better than they have been in the past and that sort of thing. So that's a place you can go to find out more stuff if you'd like to subscribe or what's it called, follow my channel. That's up to you. Now here's something I'm really proud of. This is my Facebook page, GrannyGamer1 on Facebook. There's the URL, Facebook slash GrannyGamer1. So you can go like the page because uh, I have a really eclectic feed on my personal uh, news feed. So I've been collecting things that I get off of my news feed. Here's that thing about gaming uh, and women and gaming and older people and so on. In fact, it's a pretty interesting breakdown of the fact that I am not the past, uh, that Granny Gamer One is actually uh, a harbinger of the future, that it's not going to be teenage white boys from Western European and American countries anymore. It's pretty much everybody else. Uh, and just things I find around on the web, especially relating to kids and kids rights and what's important to children and uh, treating children like human beings what a concept so yeah if you want if you do facebook either way whatever is easiest for you or whatever your parents will allow i don't allow violence and bad language and cruelty and bullying and stuff on my page i almost forgot to tell you about something really important to me and that is planet minecraft 
Now, I discovered them when I was looking for downloads of maps and builds to show you guys on my channel. And I've since become pretty involved. Not way involved, but pretty involved. And the response has been really interesting. A lot of people are, that I really wasn't expecting, a lot of people are reading and commenting on my blog posts and forum posts. I'm getting diamonds. Of course, the most popular one was the one about Notch and Microsoft buying Mojang. Bruce got cracking down when I was hypothesizing that Minecraft might be for sale before the announcement by either Microsoft or Mojang. So yeah, I got a lot of new subscribers as a result and I'm pretty amazed at the response. Not just about me, of course, because I'm just showing you the stuff that I've put up but if you go to the page and just kind of wander around there's stuff about everything if you need a texture pack a skin uh, if you're interested in mods banners to promote your server or your channel or whatever there's a really active forum with a lot of beautiful stuff on it planet minecraft is us it's the users uh, we're developing all kinds of gameplay and ideas and builds and you name it, it's in there. They're really good articles. Some of them are news articles. Some of them are uh, opinion pieces about the community, about things like bullying, about the way servers are operated. It's a very vibrant and active community and if you want to learn about the game, it's a really good place to do it. Um, if you like something that you see, and uh, oh i highly recommend leaving comments people get credit for getting comments i highly recommend if you find somebody who's really interesting to you that you uh subscribe to them see so that you will get information about other things that they uh produce and then i'm just clicking on this for an example but a lot of the builds and mods and so on are downloadable i do have ad block on so you really can't see what goes on but there are ads on these things and people get uh, a little bit of money for folks who click on the ads. So it's a way to generate a little bit of income to put back into things like operating your server or doing your mod work or your texture pack work or whatever it is you're doing. So it helps compensate people for the work that they're producing on Minecraft. So I highly recommend it. It's a really nice community, very active community. It's a well-run site. Uh, the forums are moderated, that sort of thing. They don't tolerate bullying and abuse and that kind of stuff. So I would really recommend you check it out. And also, if you, if you go and if you register, would you please consider subscribing to Granny Gamer 1? Uh, it will really help me out. I'm working my way up through the rankings. I don't want you to do it if you're not interested in my work, of course. I only want people who are actually interested in the work I'm producing and that in the future our server will be producing. But go check it out for your own self, whether it has anything to do with me or not, okay? Planet Minecraft. It's a really exciting website and it's beautifully run. And it's for us.